Welcome back to the Pulse Studios, home of 94.7, the Pulse Community Radio and Pulse Television. We'd love to see your Instagram photos of our beautiful region like these. Find and tag Pulse Television on your photos. Now here's Dylan with some local BMX talent. All right, Dylan Godfrey here today. We're here with Ben Scott. Ben, how you going? I'm good, Dylan. How are you, mate? Yeah, I'm pretty good. Uh, just the basics first. Uh, how old are you and where are you from? I'm 16 and I'm from Lara. All right, Ben, how'd you get into BMX? Well, I always went to the skate park on my penny board and I saw Nathan Watts riding and he was an absolute inspiration. He's a good rider and I thought I'd take up BMX. Me and Nathan are like best friends now. All right, Ben, how long have you been riding BMX for? I've been riding BMX for about four years now. I've been on a bike since I was three. I like bikes. Alright Ben, thanks for coming and checking up with us. We'll hope to hear from you soon. No worries, Dylan. I haven't seen it yet. I'm still up at midnight. Showing me the red. It's not crowded, we don't have traffic, we have everything we need, the snow is closed, the beach is closed, the rocks are closed, it's the perfect place. Freshwater Creek is only a short drive from Geelong, where Bethany tours the Steiner School. I'm at Freshwater Creek Steiner School, which is on the way between Geelong and Anglesey. We're going to find out a little bit about the Rudolf Steiner philosophy and why the education here is different to the mainstream system. Joseph Keshkometi, he's the facilitator at Freshwater Creek Steiner School. Joseph, can you tell me what is the Steiner philosophy? We probably like to think of ourselves of, as developing the whole human being, very holistic education, and uh, we use all of the academic disciplines to actually help to bring that about. There's a strong artistic focus, so you'll see paintings and craft work, and you'll see uh, academic work uh, somehow mixed in with story and with art. We have a prep to six at the school. We have one composite class, which is the five six. And what does Steiner education offer that mainstream education doesn't? They actually stay with the teacher for a long time. There's an apprenticeship of six to seven years. And uh, so that makes the teacher extremely accountable. So quite, quite, uh, you know, it's definite, uh, you know, as to the problems that might arise or the positives or whatever, but there's certainly a sense of responsibility and great sense of commitment on the part of the teachers and the children themselves. When it comes to the teachers, what training do they have? They uh, often will go through and do their university degree and, and um, become registered in whatever state. But then um, after that, there's, there's a period of training that they quite often do, which can be two to three years on top of that. 
So they learn how to approach the curriculum holistically and how to work with the arts and music and uh, all kinds of methods of bringing that in. It's quite uh, something. We do ongoing development, so we're a collegium of teachers so that we actually share our curriculum and what we're doing in our classes all the time. What is the, the role of play in learning for a child? We believe that in the play and the free expression, children have developed the foundations of learning itself. It's very important that children get a chance to play and explore. Most things are founded on trial and error about learning and exploring. We're here in Freshwater Creek. It's a very small area. All the children uh, can't just be coming from Freshwater Creek. Where are they from? Well, they, interestingly enough, they, they come here from diverse areas uh, there, and there are quite a few families who relocate to the area because it's a Steiner school. What are the next steps for the school here in Freshwater Creek? Well, we're growing and uh, we're certainly, recently we've had a spate of enrolments and the school is growing and uh, becoming popular. It's a young school. They, they uh, come here really because they believe in the loving environment for the children and they believe in a, a very wonderful arts focus that we bring as well. Well, thank you very much for uh, speaking with us today, Joseph. Thank you. Thanks very much. I'm Bethany Keats for Pulse Television at the Freshwater Creek Steiner School. I like the yu-yangs. Yes, yeah, because they're pretty. Yeah, and it's really relaxing. <laughs>